really, really tightly regulated and tightly controlled. So if there's allergens present, if there's immune activation, if there are nutritional deficiencies, especially in fats, it is not uncommon for these cells to not grow correctly. When the cells don't grow correctly, you'll have little patches of incomplete, uh, incompletely covered skin. That's what eczema really is. It's, it's skin that is exposed and not covered up appropriately by the dead skin cells. So it's basically an issue of skin cells not dividing properly. When that occurs, once again, as we always say, go back to the digestive system. That means look for food problems. Look for digestive problems. Look for uh, issues with specific foods, then eliminate those foods. That's step number one for eczema. And I should tell you this, Stan. It's super easy to completely eliminate eczema and never, ever, ever have it again. You're not going to get that kind of result from a doctor because all a doctor is going to give you is an immune suppressant. This is what eczema, this is the standard treatment for eczema. They give you a steroid cream. A steroid cream suppresses immunity. And let me tell you something. I know I've said it before, but every time I think about it, it just makes me mad. The stupidest, stupidest, stupidest thing, uh, the dumbest medical strategy is to suppress the immune system and call the patient healed or to build the patient after you suppress the immune system. Suppression of the immune system is like telling the army to stand down when the enemy is present it's because you don't want to have a war. Well, the point of eczema is not to have the army stand down, but to eliminate the enemy. And the enemy comes in various guises. Number one, it comes in foods, and that means eliminate foods. But lack of nutrition can be an enemy also, and that means specifically fat. So use essential fatty acids. Get on the ultimate EFAs. Have, have your friend, or you said your sister, I think whoever it was, have them use three ultimate EFAs morning, noon, and night. Make sure they're taking it with food and make sure they're taking their ultimate enzymes with digestive enzymes and with apple cider vinegar. You can also use vitamin E, 400 international units a day, and you can also use vitamin C. Both of those can help skin cells divide more appropriately and more, more correctly. And you can also use topical vitamin C on eczema, but you want to make sure that you're using your topical vitamin C and uh, you're getting your topical vitamin C in its fatty form, not its watery form. Form. Ascorbic acid, the watery form of vitamin C, isn't going to help your eczema, but ascorbyl palmitate, which is fatty vitamin C, that can do some really wonderful things for all healing, including eczema. A couple other miscellaneous things that you might want to try uh, are, uh, are zinc, both internally and topically, 50 milligrams of zinc picolinate a day, and then also uh, topical zinc in the form of zinc oxide. That can get you some relief, although zinc oxide is a little white, and some people don't like that, but that might help uh, get you some relief, uh, topical zinc oxide cream, and then also the Z-radical and the probiotics, including the Beyond Organic products. That might help, too, help stabilize the gut. So think digestion, think problem foods, think fats and fatty materials, and then uh, fatty substances like vitamin E and essential fatty acids, digestive enzymes to help you process those fats, and then also topical vitamin C as well as topical zinc. All of those are wonderful strategies for dealing with eczema. Last but not least, getting out in the sun sometimes helps also. Uh, the sun will help, her make, help your friend make vitamin D, and vitamin D is important for helping cells grow correctly. How does that help you, Stan? Yes, I have one more uh, uh, friend that has yes. two children that her doctor told her that her children have hereditary eczema. What do you think about that? Well, that's just that's just dumb, stupid doctor talk. Hereditary eczema. What does that What does that mean? That everybody in the family had eczema because everybody had a digestive problem? I mean, I, I, just, that's what I can't I address her, that. I that's said. too. That's too nonsensical to address, and I'm not even going to give the doctor credit for saying something that's stupid. We're, going to, we're just going to attribute it to a misunderstanding. Perhaps the patient okay. misunderstood what the doctor said. Uh, we'll leave it at that. Thank you so much, Dan. Have All a right, good day, you. man. Thanks for calling. Whew, that is crazy. Hereditary eczema. What does that mean? That everybody is in the family has eczema? It's, it's in the genes to have eczema? My goodness. All right, Kim in Florida, what's up? Welcome to the Bright Side. Oh, thank you, Ben, for your wonderful work. Um, I heard you thank mention you. that we could uh, get some serotonin by looking at the sun um, early yes. in the morning. But I didn't know if you met only at sunrise or during the day. Well, serotonin is serotonin is manufactured in response to the sun. But first thing in the morning, you've got lots of melatonin. If you're healthy anyway, you've got lots of melatonin because melatonin is made up at, is, is built up at night. And melatonin can get converted into serotonin via this reaction from the sun. So, uh, yes, first thing in the morning, you tend to get a big burst of
the serotonin if you look if you look right at the sun or expose yourself somehow to the sun. But during the day, that's going to happen also. And in fact, the sun is like nature's Prozac in a way because it helps you make serotonin. So one of the greatest ways to build your own serotonin if you're having ser- to suspect there's serotonin issues. And by the way, many of us self-medicate to try to build our serotonin levels by eating sugar. And if you're one of those folks that can't get off the carbohydrates, the breads and the pastas and the sugars, there's a very good possibility that you're self-medicating in the sense that eating sugar is one way that the body makes serotonin or upregulates the manufacture of serotonin. So a great way to get yourself off of sugar is to build your serotonin up naturally by getting out in the sun. And you'll notice that when you're out in the sun, you don't feel like eating, not just sugars. You just don't feel like eating anyway. So getting out in the sun, in addition to having appetite suppressant effects, partially via serotonin, is also a great way to get off that uh, high blood sugar, low blood sugar roller coaster and to keep yourself from self-medicating with carbohydrates. So to answer your question, yes, you're going to get serotonin during the day by exposing yourself, getting out in the sun, but you'll also get a big burst of it by looking directly in the sun first thing in the morning. Have you tried that, by the way, Kim? Yes, and I didn't know if it was like for a couple seconds or more. Yeah, no, you can do it. You know, you don't want to hurt yourself, but a couple seconds, 10, 15 seconds. I usually do it for somewhere from 10 to 15 seconds, but I know some, it's called sun gazing, by the way. And if you Google sun gazing, you'll get a lot of good information. And uh, some people will sun gaze for 30 seconds or even more. I do it for 10 or 15 seconds. Have you done it at all, Kim? Have you tried yes, it yet? Yes, and I, I did see some improvement, but I didn't know if it worked during the day as well. Or maybe the, the sun is too strong for your eyes during the day. Yeah. Um, you may not. It won't. It wouldn't be a problem for you as long as you're healthy. But even just exposing your body to the sun can help. And try it. Uh, try taking like maybe two or three uh, milligrams of melatonin before you go to bed at night, and then see if you notice a difference when you look at the sun first thing in the morning. Got to move, Kim. Thanks so much for your call and thanks for your kind words. That's all the time we have for today. I'm Pharmacist Ben. We'll be back at you tomorrow talking about protein and arginine. Thanks for listening, folks. Have a wonderful, beautiful day. We'll talk to y'all later. Bye for now. Hey everyone, have you heard about the no-no hair removal device that's sweeping the globe? If you want to go weeks without shaving and get smooth, professional quality results, here's our favorite host Cheryl for no-no hair removal. Thanks. Hey gals, I love talking about my no-no. It's this cute little hair removal system that you can take with you and use almost anywhere at home or on the road. No more expensive in-office treatments, painful waxing, and no more wasting your valuable time. Got unwanted facial hair? No-no hair has patented Thermacon technology that works on all hair and skin colors. So it's perfect for using on all body parts. And now you can take advantage of this incredible risk-free trial. Get the no-no, the facial kit, a travel case, and a $100 discount shopping card. And you don't risk a penny to try it. Try the incredible no-no hair completely risk-free. Call 1-800-953-6062. That's 800-953-6062. 800-953-6062. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document? Worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average over 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE. 855-340-SAVE.